Good afternoon, Vitamin Water. It's Lauren here today at the Hazleton Hotel with Mr. Michael Ackenbaum. How's it going, man? Going great. Thank you so much. Thank you for taking the time to speak with us today. I understand that you are a very busy man, one of New York's finest. How would you describe it? Um, well, we're real estate developers and hoteliers, so uh, we've been doing uh, hotels. My father's been doing hotels for 30 years, but I started in the business about 10 years ago, and we opened the first hotel in the Meatpacking District in New York, and since then we've opened three other hotels. We're obviously big fans of the Toronto Film Festival so we did uh, an event with uh, Matt at uh, Goodnight and it's a great bar and we just thought it sounded great to do Goodnight Gansevoort so it's a late night uh, event each night during the film festival and I think we've had a really great response from the community. The rumor on the street is that it's very very exclusive. Are you able to share any of the names of talent that have come by or is that kind of? Um, I mean we've had a few uh, actually interestingly enough a lot of Canadian celebrities that have come through um, you know, I'm sure it'll leak. We don't usually generally uh, put the word out about who's coming to our event. Justin Bieber? Uh, we don't put the word out about who's coming to our events. But uh, no, but we've had a, a great response. And, and more importantly than just the celebrities is, is really the, the people who are the tastemakers of the town who really want to stop by and experience uh, a little bit of what we try to do and a little bit of what Matt does at his, at his spot. And, and we're really excited that we've worked, all worked together so well. Let's talk a bit about the film festival. Have you got a chance to go out and see any of the movies or is it just straight up parties for you? Um, luckily for me, I got invited to the Oranges premiere yesterday, which uh, was a really interesting movie. It was really enjoyable, and uh, the, the acting was incredible. Uh, and then we were uh, able to throw them their after party at the uh, Goodnight Gansevoort venue. So, so that was a really uh, great thing to be able to do. The city kind of explodes during this week, and I know in New York you have celebrities all the time. You're probably very used to seeing famous people. Do you notice a different kind of energy in Toronto? I mean, it's 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 interesting. I mean, it's funny because in LA, you you tend to see people much more interested in celebrity than in New York. In New York, people are a little bit more um, relaxed about it. Um, Toronto, because it doesn't get it as often, um, I understand you know why people are so excited. And you definitely see you feel an energy on the streets. People are are definitely interested in seeing who's coming, who's going. Um, and you know, our job is just to cater to whoever you know comes. We we you know we're not specific to who, who it is, whether it's celebrity or not celebrity, everyone's treated with respect, so so we, we enjoy having those kinds of guests as well, but at the same time, um, it's not our focus. Our focus is on just uh, just providing great service while we're, while we're in town doing our thing. If you can have any memory that kind of stands out from TIFF, what's your greatest memory from the film festival? I think uh, seeing Wyclef and Shakira perform at One by One a couple of years ago was, was amazing. Um, just a unique thing that doesn't happen very often to have two such talented people get together on the stage and then you know Matt Damon and Ben Affleck were doing such charitable things during the event so so I mean I think that you know when you see people like that getting out of their going out of their way to do something as as uh, valuable as what one by one is trying to accomplish I think that's a tremendous thing um, so I guess that would be my number one thing because it was just a to see you know her do a special appearance during Y class performance was really amazing it was the middle of a tour for her so she actually stopped the tour popped up and did that as a favor to Y class which I thought was a really generous thing. Yeah, One by One is an awesome charity. I really like what they do. Cool. Well, thank you so much for taking the time to speak with us. Can I get a high five? Yeah. Uh, is that okay? Uh -huh. Actually, by the way, my girlfriend tries to give me high fives and I won't ever give her a high five. So I'm going to take that I just gave you a high five. There you go. Exclusive high five.